The United States is a country on Earth with 50 states. It's powerful and it's American. It's pretty cold and human beings are trying to spread all over the planet. They reached the edge and they got sticks and babies. Hey guys, check out this bridge. It goes to the other side of the world. And there's a lot of food. Oh, nice. Well, you're all stuck now. Okay, so people are chilling out on the land, gathering food and hunting mammoths. Well, they died, but they got a backup. Hey, now that we got food and land, let's form a society. Oh, someone just discovered gambling, but more importantly, someone just discovered farming. Wait, we could have just planted stuff in the ground? Yeah. And soon everybody learned about this, planting corn in the process. Hey, now that we got farming, let's form a better society. Then they make some hills, then they die, but they still make those hills, making a city around one. Meanwhile, the Mayans become so obsessed with the snow. Then, they collapse. Some natives in the west liked the desert, building their town under some rocks. North America was getting pretty diverse, pretty complicated, and pretty beautiful. Sort of. The Aztec and the Inca empires are getting started. Wait, hold up, check out this boat. Knock knock. It's Columbus. From Europe. Yo, what's up my Indians? Where my spice is at? Columbus politely asked his disease killed the entire population. Hey Spain, I found India. India? And so Europe began legally assaulting the Americas. Sorry guys, give it a second. Wait, this isn't even India, but dang, check out these resources. Hey Portugal, I'll take all of this and you take this tiny chunk cause I'm better than you. In the meantime, let's use the natives to do the work for us. But the natives died, remember? So plan B. Check out the new Columbus Triangle thing, now in business. I want a bigger slice of that wealth cake, suckers. The British are off to set up a colony, second try by the way, and they did it. Look at that tobacco. Britain kind of sucked religiously. Ew, said the pilgrims, sailing away for Jesus. Dude, let's make some colonies, with more colonies, in the middle. I can't eat pork, but bacon just made slavery popular. England still sucks. Hey guys, check out my new crib, you can do whatever you want. Check out those immigrants. Let's talk about the South. Here, slavery was a big hit. What did Britain do about this? Nothing. Sweet, we're free. Because we gotta stay Christian. Europe was getting intellectual. The colonists heard about it and started reading stuff like John Locke, Adam Smith, Toad, understanding liberty and democracy. Check this one out. Britain and France are killing each other. Britain wins and they're broke. Damn, we need some cash. Hey, can we go west? No. Also give us money. So Britain starts taxing the hell out of the colonies. Something just happened in Boston, and Revere told everybody, let's dump some tea in the ocean cause they taxed it. Hey Britain, can you stop ignoring us? Britain didn't really care, they just kept doing it. Okay, we gotta talk about this people. So Britain's clapping us right now, but I think we can still make peace with them. Look, another shooting. And Revere told everybody, that's not happening, said Thomas Paine, writing a book about independence. Now people hated Britain, and they declared independence. You guys suck. You want to team up against Britain? And they destroy Cornwallis. And they win. Get out of here, Britain! Now we're in control. Bro, we need a government. They create a constitution, but a bunch of farmers made it fail. Okay, we gotta talk about this, people. We need to remaster our government. The states had some ideas. Let's just do both and create the Congress and stuff. Some people like this, but some people didn't like it. So they add 10 rules to make sure they like it. We need a leader! So they invent the president, and everyone made it this guy because he was such a legend during the war. Nice bank, Hamilton. Wait, how strict should the Constitution be? Yes. No. Goodbye, Washington. Wait, he's got something to say. Don't make political parties. Worst mistake of my life. Okay in America, creating them anyway. Hey, can we not follow the law? Whoa, France is going cray cray right now. Probably because we did that. Napoleon wants to remake an empire with this huge chunk of land he's got. He failed. Might as well sell it. Hey, do you want my land? Okay. Some people saw Jefferson as a hypocrite after this. I did it! I ended slavery! Said Eli Whitney, inventing something that just increased it. What is Britain doing? Dude, they're stealing our semen! Never mind, it's land. Let's go! Nice, new reform movements. Now slavery is becoming controversial. Yo, they're using machines now? What the heck? And it made the North more complicated. Everyone's moving to cities. And slavery's still bad, but you know, it's balanced perfectly. Hey guys, I want to become a state, specifically a slave state. Yes, sir! Let's go. <sighs> Screw you, we're adding Maine to the gang. 
Hey Europe, stay out of our area, you're pathetic. Henry Clay just announced a dank new system. We'll be good if the South didn't hate it. John C. Calhoun's evading taxes again. I want to remove the natives. You can't. Why? Because we said so. Okay. And he removed the natives. Check out the wigs versus the donkeys. Industry is fire right now, but factory working is horrible. Let's just stop working. Let's go west because we're American. They go west, kicking the natives in Mexico in the process. A lot of Irish people just died, so everybody starts immigrating to the country. This sucks, said the Know Nothing Party, knowing nothing on foreign influence. We got more land, but how do we use it? Okay, that new land from Mexico? No slaves here. You can make a political party out of this. It didn't work, but it did piss off the south. Don't worry, I got this, said Henry Clay again, adding California after our gold thing happened there. It didn't go well. Frick it, let's let the people decide. Never mind. The woman just had a pretty cool meetup advocating better rights. Introducing the elephants, as if donkeys weren't enough. Hey, excuse me, I'm in the north and my master died. Can I be free and be like a citizen? No. Cause you're black. The nation started falling apart. After all, the last several presidents didn't really even do anything. Guys, I'm Lincoln, and slavery is disgusting. I'm running for president, by the way. By the way, he won. Wait, guys, I won't take away your slaves. Just chill for a bit. Yeah! Nah. The country's fighting itself. Guys, we need to fight like a snake right now. I'm gonna free the slaves. Except it didn't really do anything, but it did change the idea. Now we're destroying slavery. Yo, but we're still fighting pretty good. Not anymore. The North just set the South on fire, and they eventually died. Hey, nice, we won. Lincoln's actually chilling now. And he gets assassinated. Great, now we gotta rebuild everything. The South kind of still did slavery and pretended the war never happened. The whites wanted to stay the best race, so they start using violence. And now the US was looking beautiful on the outside, but disgusting in the inside. Businesses became bigger, but the working conditions became badder. This sucks, said the Knights of Labor. Yeah, we're only taking skilled workers, bro. Hey farmers, do you hate railroads? And mechanized farming? Introducing the Grangers, now the populists. The South was getting more industrialized, but now more racist. No, no, trust me, it's separate, but equal. I'm gonna buy everybody. Wait, why don't we donate all our money for society? Sweetie, let's focus on the cities, which are garbage right now. Introducing the progressives. Let's fix that crap. Oh shoot, we just ran out of land. That's some good grub right there. But Spain controls Cuba. You sunk our ship? Bro, we didn't even do anything. <laughs> now we got that grub, including the Philippines? This is lit, said William McKinley, getting assassinated. And they lose Cuba. The United States becomes a world power while doing some other stuff too. Sherman's vice president, not William Sherman, this a different Sherman, under the new president, William Sherman, Taft. While Europe's killing themselves in this war, the US was actually chilling. Germany just ruined it. I'm gonna show you what democracy feels like. Wait, we already did this scene. After the war, Germany was the dunce force to pay a lot of money. Check out the League of Nations. Can you guys join it, please? No. Whoops, a disease just killed everybody. Russia just became the Soviet Union, and it scared the crap out of everybody. Alcohol just got banned. That's kind of sick. And women got the right to vote. Finally. Hey, blacks, tired of the South? Move to the North and share that epic culture. The 1920s were now in cars, watching movies and breaking it down. And this stock thing's gonna do good. Just kidding. Hoover tried doing something but failed. Then FDR comes in with the New Deal and it actually worked, but it failed. Yo, Germany's going wild, Italy's going wild, and Japan? Guys, we should team up and take over the entire world. Damn it, I gotta run for a third term. The US did their same brilliant move and was actually just chilling. Japan wanted more land, but they were scared of the US, so Japan spits on them. They declare war, and the others declare war on the US. Hey, that's what friends do. The US is making a big fat bomb, like a really big one. We gotta take down Germany, man. They're freaking crazy. So they take down Germany. Then the US starts taking down Japan. Roosevelt died and Harry Truman carries on the presidency. Mr. President, we can't invade the mainland. Our soldiers will die. Bro, let's just use the bomb. So they drop it on Japan. Twice.
The war ended after that. Goodbye, League of Nations. Hello, United Nations. But we got a problem. These two don't even like each other. They start another war. Now with nuclear bombs. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't do that, but I still hate you. It's alliance time, baby. Now with other countries to back us up. Also, Germany's in shambles. It's like the hotspot. There's some other wars going on and stuff. Back them up! Look, it's communism. And it scared the crap out of everybody. The two superpowers wanted to be better than the other. In weapons, wars, allies, and now in space. The Soviet Union just put a thing in space. Oh, heck nah! Then the US creates NASA. America is booming, like the population. Everyone's got television, and fast food becomes a revelation. Like, we're talking about the first McDonald's here. Wait, Cuba's communist? This results in the end of the world. Almost. Screw this, said Kennedy. We're going to the moon. And he gets assassinated. Racism is bad. Civil rights time. Buses. Education. Marches. Oh shoot, Luther King, man? He's standing for equality to fight racism. And the US agrees. Dude, I saw him, man. Why is everything sexy? Lyndon wants to take Vietnam to the next level, so he sends a lot of troops. The US slapped the Soviets in their face and landed the first dudes on the moon, introducing Richard Nixon. And he's done with Vietnam because it's a disaster. There goes Watergate ruining Nixon's career. Now nobody trusts the government. Iran just had a revolution, kidnapping multiple Americans because Jimmy Carter and their king were best friends. It's Reagan time. Technology is getting better too and the world's more connected. Oh my god bro, it's computers. You can check emails and play games on it. I'ma make things more free to you guys. This makes the Soviet Union collapse. But hey, at least Germany's back together. Companies start becoming bigger and bigger. Bigger. Thanks, Bill. Some buildings just got bombed. Happy New Year. Then, obliterated. Then a war starts over that. Surprise, everyone's got a cell phone now. There's the earth where I was actually born. It's on fire. And the economy crashed again. Surprise, Obama. And now, Obamacare. It's like healthcare, but from Obama. Now you can talk to people online. On your phone. Now you can order stuff online. On your phone. Everything just got shut down. And it just got political and canceled on Twitter. Then we buy the universe. Or maybe go extinct, I don't know.